Hello, YouTubers. 4077 TTM here, Ryan, with a long overdue mail day video. Uh, my apologies, it's been a few weeks since I've posted a video, and that's because I've been traveling a lot for work. And uh, that's okay because I have a couple of autographs from my travels, along with some TTMs and uh, a purchase to show you today. So, uh, a couple weeks ago, I got to go to Vegas for the first time. Never been to Las Vegas, looking forward to it, and uh, it, was a, it was a good trip. Uh, saw some good shows, including one that I had been wanting to see for a long, long time, and that is Penn and Teller. Yeah, went and saw these guys right here, Penn and Teller. Uh, if you ever are in Vegas, go to the Rio and see them. They are awesome. Had great seats, too. We were in the third row. Fantastic. I've loved these guys for years. In fact, um, back in the early 90s, Penn and Teller put out a couple of books, and I bought them, and I took one of those books with me because here's the cool thing about Penn and Teller. If you see them live, they come out after the show and sign autographs and take pictures. And I brought along this book that I've had for probably over 20 years. It's called Penn and Teller's How to Play with Your Food, and I asked them to sign it, and they did after... The show. So there's Penn and Teller right there. By the way, uh, below are some links where you can see um, some Facebook pictures of my wife and I with Penn and Teller. And also, I'm going to put down there a uh, an email address because on their website, uh, they actually have an email address where you can send an autograph request. So I'll put that down there as well. So after Vegas, I got back, had a couple of days here, and then I went to Nashville, Tennessee. Uh, for a speaking engagement I did down there and while I was there I was at the Opryland Hotel and in Opryland Hotel is the uh, is WSM AM which is one of the first radio stations in the world and was also um, and still is the home of the Grand Ole Opry and I've shown you this book before on, on a video this is a book about WSM Air Castles of the South and um, I had three of the WSM DJs sign this already, but I was wanting the fourth. I was wanting Eddie Stubbs, and he has the uh, the night show down there. So I walked down there and uh, knocked on the window, and he came out, and he signed my book. So now I have all of them, and this is right here, the brand new one. Best wishes to Ryan, Eddie Stubbs, WSM. So now I have him and Mike Terry and Keith Bilbrey and Bill Cody all in my WSM book. So that's from my travels. Came back to some good TTMs and another book. I uh, I had I had sent this gentleman, like many, uh, some photos to sign. He sent them back, but I did I, I did hear through the grapevine through the community that he signed books. So I bought a copy of the book and sent it off. And this is Mr. Kirk Douglas, yeah, Spartacus himself, and he signed it right there to Ryan. Good luck, Kirk Douglas. Very excited to get this. Very happy to get this right here. Um, he even returned the money. I sent the money to uh, send the book back, and he returned that as well. So, so happy to finally have that in my collection. Another TTM that I received, I actually received this guy a few weeks ago, um, but I'm glad that he sent it another one. See, I had sent, I had written him twice, and uh, uh, the second letter I sent is what I got back uh, just a couple of weeks ago. This is from the first letter I sent. This is Todd Sussman, who was one of two of the uh, PA announcers on MASH. And I'm so glad I got this one because he actually, the, the photos I sent him uh, the second time, he signed on the back. And this one he signed on the front. So glad to have that now on the front. Uh, my friend Greg Poole, he sent me another card. He, he sends me cards that he, uh, uh, ha he finds uh, that are uh, signed. And uh, this is actually a basketball card. And this is uh, from the Timberwolves. This is Chris Carr. And uh, Chris Carr, he, uh, the reason that this is uh, noteworthy for, for uh, me is because uh, I live just down the road from Southern Illinois University. And uh, Chris Carr played for Southern Illinois University before going to the NBA and having some moderate success in the NBA. So glad to get that. 
uh, purchase. This is actually something I bought. Um, uh, one of my favorite bands reunited recently and put out some brand new music, and they're touring now. And they had a, uh, a special on their website where you could buy the brand new CD and have a, a signed insert from that CD. And uh, these are the Mavericks right here. And uh, there they are, the entire band, signing the CD insert. This is their brand new CD in time, and I recommend it. Very good. And uh, if you've never heard the Mavericks, uh, I, I, I definitely uh, encourage you to check them out. All right, and I'm going to finish up with uh, several TTMs that I got from Florida. Yes, from the St. Louis Cardinals spring break. Spring break. Spring training. <laughs> they're not on spring break. They're in spring training. Um the first year I've sent to uh, uh, spring training and my Cardinals, they're my team. So I uh, sent to them and have had some success, uh, mainly from the, uh, the minor league players and some of the utility players, but I'm still very happy with those. Uh, this is uh, one of their minor league players right here. Um, and I'm not sure how to pronounce his last name, but uh, his name is Kevin Segrist or Sigrist. Uh, but he signed this photo for me right there. This guy, he was, uh, on the team last year and uh, helped them get to the postseason. This is Victor Marte. He's the one pouring champagne on... Uh, who is that that he's pouring it on? Maybe John Jay. Not sure, but uh, he signed it right there on his, his red champagne-soaked shirt. Uh, just received this one today. Another utility player for the Cardinals. This is Shane Robinson signing that photo. And... My index card, pretty cool. This guy was really big in the uh, last part of uh, last season and in the postseason. Uh, really kind of gave him a spark that they needed, and uh, cool to get him. This is Pete Cosma, who uh, might just be our starting shortstop now that Farcal is out for the season. There's one there, and another one from Pete Cosma right there. Pretty cool. Uh, last Friday, I received this uh, guy, got, getting a lot of pitchers in, and uh, this is one of the relief pitchers. They call him Scrabble because his name is about 15 words long. This is Mark, Z uh, Mark Zepchinski. <laughs> I can't even pronounce it. Mark Zepchinski. Um, and what's interesting is I got this on Friday, and the same day, Friday, uh, he got hit in the eyeball with a uh, golf ball. He was playing golf and, and got hit in the eye with a, a golf ball. So uh, was kind of unclear whether or not he pitched, but um, it appears that he's doing much better now and hopefully we'll be able to pitch. And finally, the, uh, the final uh, autograph I got, and I'm very happy to get this guy because I'm a fan of this guy. He's the closer for the Cardinals. And that would be Mr. Jason Mott signing that photo, signing that photo, and also signing my Wreckers card. So, very cool to get that. That's it. I know, that's a lot, but uh, that's about three weeks worth of stuff that I've been accumulating, and I've uh, been a little behind on getting some TTMs out in the mail, but I hope to rectify that this week. So hopefully some more videos on the horizon. Uh, anyway, may your mailboxes be full. Hope you have a great day, and I will talk to you next time. This is 4077TTM, signing off.